Hello, my name is Gregory Lyons, and I'm here to clear up some myths about religion versus atheism because I'm just fed up. I'm fed up of hearing um, some of these things that people think if, you're, if you say you're an atheist. I'm an atheist. Uh, atheism means I don't believe in a God, I don't believe in Jesus, I don't believe in Allah, I don't believe in uh, traditional historical references to religious figures. They're mythical, they're make-believe, they're made up. Uh, what it doesn't mean, however, because a lot of people, the first argument they come up with, especially Bible thumpers, and Bible by B-I-B-L-E, I mean B-U-Y-B-U-L-L. -L. Yes, I ridicule the Bible because it's caused a lot of problems throughout history, a lot of murders in the name of God, torturing, but I'll get to that. But the, what it doesn't mean when they say, I'm an atheist, is uh, the argument they come up with, well, you worship Satan, you worship the devil, you're God. No, 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 no. I don't believe in God, I don't believe in the devil either. I don't believe in heaven, I don't believe in hell. I do believe in love. Okay, because the other assumption is, well, if you're an atheist, you don't believe in love. No, love is real. You can love another person, another seeable person. What I believe religion breaks down to, uh, religion versus no religion, is uh, nonsense versus sense. Common sense, okay? Nonsense is making believe that there's some big guy up there who's looking down and watching every move you make, including when you're uh, masturbating. Uh, to, to, and, and making some sort of checklist that I, when you die, because everybody dies, when you die either you go up to heaven or down to hell. Either you go to this eternal country club uh, where you get to just do more of the same boring things you've been doing here on earth, or you go, you, and, and everybody's happy of course, like they're high, or you go to hell where you're just tortured every day. You're tortured, you burn, you're burning, lake of fire, all that nonsense. That's nonsense. Absolutely utter nonsense. Okay? Uh, sense is just believing in reality, the real things that happen. And, uh, you know, cramming yourself into a church, begging forgiveness for being born, uh, that's nonsense. That's absolute nonsense. Okay? There's, um, that's it. That's just, so atheism is, there's no, there's no big one God that created himself out of nothing and then started making these little beings on planet Earth and then, uh, you know, cre created a sun come down here and die to take his, your sins with him. No, no, nonsense, absolute nonsense. And the Jesus story is just a repetition of previous sacrificial stories, and it usually had to do with crops. It usually had to, the, the Greeks, uh, they, they would sacrifice one male among the, the village to, to grow better crops, because they believed that by showing that they really wanted the crops to grow by killing someone. You know, killing is wrong. Killing people to, to further any kind of agenda is wrong. War is wrong, and religion inspires wars, jihads. You know, the, the Muslims, uh, they're all about the jihad and fatwa and all that nonsense. Nonsense. And nonsense is what is putting this world in the big mess it's in right now. See, religion makes a mess. That's why I'm an atheist. Atheism is reality-based. Love is, is a good, real thing. Religion bad. Atheism good, okay? Be realistic. Embrace the reality. You know what it boils down to is what are we? What are we human beings? Well, basically we're a brain wrapped in a body. And this body has sensory devices. Our eyes, our nose to smell, our mouth to talk, and tongue to taste, fingers to touch, okay? And why do I bring that up? Because we can, we, our brain interprets all these other sensory uh, devices. Where does the God or Jesus or the Bible or all that nonsense enter the picture? That's strictly a contrivance brought up here. Originally made up by people who wanted to control the masses. Yes, religion is about control. Control yourself by using your intellect, by being intelligent, by casting off this other nonsense, by not giving your money away to the Vatican, which is, is, is gold, just gold. Just gold and rich old people, gold. How can you do that? How can you be that stupid? Religion, stupid. Thank you.